the Bradley County family is without their home tonight after it was destroyed in yesterday's storms. News Channel Line's Betsy Golden met them at the home today. She joins us now live with more. Betsy. Well, Calvin and Kim, good evening. Yes, now this family of four is looking for what to do next after a tree crashed into their home. Here's the stump, and the homeowner is here to show us where it crashed into the house. The maids show me the damage inside their home. This was Christy and Chris's bedroom. Now it's destroyed. A tree came through the roof of their home Sunday afternoon. Chris and their young son Leland were inside the home like when it happened. It sounded like a uh, huge wind tunnel. After I heard that, next thing you know, I seen the tree coming through the trailer. Any other day, Leland would be asleep in that bed. But as good fortune would have it, Chris and Leland were in the room next door watching TV before nap time. My instant dad mode kicked in and I, I went back there and I plug, unplugged stuff back there so it didn't catch fire. Came back in the living room, grabbed him. Christy was at work when the tree fell into their home. My husband leaves me a text message saying, um, come home now, there's a tree in, our, in the trailer. The owner of the trailer park has moved them into a new home on the property. For more information on how you can help this family, log on to newschannel9.com. Reporting in Bradley County, Betsy Golden, News Channel 9. Okay, thank you, Betsy.